to bum, plan. Bum, 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 This is Flintstones for Genesis. Uh, for whatever crazy reason, all Genesis, oh, excuse me, all Flintstones games for, like, Nintendo, all Flintstones games made by Taito were, uh, are expensive and hard to find. This one complete. Uh, are you looking up? Generally goes anywhere between. 150? 130 to 200. Okay. It's also pretty rare over the past. Whoa, really? The past three months, like seven sold. Wow. So it's like. It, I don't know. I'm, I'm doing eBay on my phone, so maybe it's not perfect, but. If people cared about Genesis as much as they care about NES, this game would be like 500 bucks. Yeah, easily. So. Yeah, the nice thing about Genesis collecting is that uh, it, it tries in price uh, every year, but. People care about the Super Nintendo way more. Honestly, I like Flintstones games, except for the one made off of the movie, where, you know, like, the actual, like, John Goodman movie. But, like, Surprise of Dinosaur Peak is fine. The other NES one, uh, Dino and Hoppy, is better. And then the Super Nintendo one, Sierra something or other, is, like, really good. I like that one quite a bit. So, they're really solid platformers. Yeah. Yeah, for whatever reason, they're just like, yeah, Flintstones... Gotta give it good some... Uh, Taito. It's it's pretty much because Taito. Yeah. I guess it was just one of those things that, like... I mean, the Turtles games were so good because Konami was behind them. Tiny Toons as well. Yep. yep. So you just gotta find the good uh, Japanese developer. Capcom, Taito, Konami. Does... I forget if we look this up. Does Taito exist anymore in any sense? I... Ooh. This is already pretty tough. This is, this is hard. What the heck? Why is this so hard? Oh my god! Yeah, what the heck? Oh. Oh. oh! And you have it on easy. Yeah, I don't know how much that actually affects everything. I guess it gave we'll you give more. Give this another good try. Yeah. <laughs> this is the first time we've ever we've ever played this one. Dude, throwing up? Ledges is weird. It does seem a little odd. Like, you gotta get, like... It's like a very specific angle yeah. and positioning. Which I'm sure later on becomes even more annoying, because I'm sure it's, like, over ravines, you know? Like, you have to be, like, just far enough away, but not too far. This is pretty dope. It's a very, uh... It's a weird sound signature, uh... It's not as, like, twangy as Genesis can sound, but it sounds weird. Yeah. It's not as twangy and bassy. Man. Okay. Yeah, you gotta get these just right. Yeah, you gotta, like, jump and hit the thing at the same time, or else you don't have enough time. This is... Why is this so hard? Alright, let's try to do this. Like this. No, you gotta... If I die, I'll give it to you. <laughs> Alright, let me try. These are why they're called Let's Tries. Literally, let me try. Okay. B's jump. Yeah, it's A or C or C. Okay. Okay. We got this, fans. Alright. Let's do this. Let's do this. We're not going to get filtered by this children's game within the first... What? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know that? That's funny. <laughs> I think I've played the Flintstones games a little too much. Because they all have, like, a very similar kind of, like, feel. Yes. Uh, okay. That's how you do it. Ah, dang yeah, so you just hit it when you're not jumping. I was overcomplicating it. Yeah, I was trying to do that weird jump hit at the same time. Yeah. It's impossible. No, that would be very hard. Uh, two. I'm not, uh, whoa! whoa! Okay, this is pretty cool. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh God. Senpai, please. What is that? Points. Go on. Give me all these. Whatever this is, I want it. I want it all. Oh, I, I need to get up to six hearts. You have seven of those uh, red 
stars. Yeah, I'm like, does, is it like a special? Maybe you have to get ten to get a life or something. Gift. Yeah, okay. I'm yeah, Yoshi. I'm Yoshi. Yeah, <laughs> literally. Ooh, the slowdown. Okay, I guess but, this is. But blast processing. Truly random in that I cannot get to a lot what? of these. Yeah, weird. Like I, I can't reach any of these. Oh, oh. oh yeah. Now it makes sense, okay. And he has, like, quite the reach. Okay, okay. That makes a lot more sense, because I was like, dude, I cannot reach these. Enjoy your egg. What does it do? <laughs> I don't know, but I'm at three. It, like, follows you in the weirdest way. Oh my god, that was an actual death thing. Ah! What? <laughs> oh, fuck! <laughs> now the egg's gone, I guess. <laughs> this game is like, this game is so random. Did the egg give me an extra hit? Is that what it was? I don't yeah, know. but this game is pretty cool. Uh -oh. Dude, this game is pretty awesome. Yeah. It's one of those where, like, should it be worth 150 USD? No. I mean, is uh, Return to Dinosaur Peak worth, what, 600 card alone? <laughs> I think it's more than that. I just threw it around the number. Yeah, it's... It's $1,000 card alone. Okay. Ooh, got this. Yeah, no, it is not. <laughs> very, few ga I, very few games, in my opinion, are worth over $100 just from game play alone. Uh, a couple off the top of my head. Here's a question of the part. No one's going to answer, but I don't care. I don't care. Uh, what's a game that, in your opinion, is worth more than $100 in terms of just out of gameplay? Uh, here's two. Oh. I'd pay over $100 for Sonic Frontier. Hey, that's, that's another one. Uh, here's, here's two others. Uh, Super Mario RPG and Mega Man X. Yeah, I mean, I've probably beaten Mega Man X. 50 times. Thanks, Fred. You're a deer. Yabba da. <laughs> yeah. oh, God, please. Stop. Why do they. Do you know what that reminds me of? Freddy's here, TM. <laughs> Freddy TM's here <laughs> from Nightmare on Elm Street. God, it ruins it. Hey, look, it's Barney TM. Hey, Fred, if you want me to look for I'll share my fish with you. Hey, Barney, why don't you yabba dabba go? F your <laughs> All right, so, uh, stage two. Ooh. So Fred, uh, has, uh, unlimited breathing. That's good. Because he's Fred Flintstone. <laughs> Imagine if they made this like Sonic. God. Well, I guess we don't know yet. I just want to talk about how weird as Sonic water stages are and how they consistently have stayed the same way forever. And I just don't understand why. Can I go forever or does... Do I have, like, a limit? Okay, you don't actually... I was, like, worried that you actually have to get them, and you don't. That's Why nice. did it turn black for a second, though? Because I hit that, uh, one, uh, lightning enemy. Oh, uh, okay. This is floaty, but purposefully. Yeah. It looks like it doesn't control. I'm not gonna lie. that This is a game I could play the whole way through. I don't think we really have the time for it today. But... Or, I... And, obviously, I haven't practiced or anything. I'm also not gonna pretend that I'd be able to beat it in one yeah. go. But especially since you can pick up a lot of hearts and have a lot of hits, that is quite nice. So yeah, maybe I'll go a couple more minutes. More of just a let's try. This might be one I revisit in the future, though. Yeah. Maybe I'll go on a Flintstone spree and just uh, play them all, because for whatever reason, and I guess, I guess the reason that being Taito, they are pretty fun. I love games like that, too. Stuff you would not expect to be good. And then they just are. Like Bucky O'Hare. Yeah. Based I, off of a TV show that no one watched. That had like, I don't know, 10 episodes. Konami gets the hands on it and make just an amazing Mega Man clone. Yeah, it's like one of the best games on the system. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. That was time. 
Dude, Fred was taking that so casually. Yeah. It was like a stroll in the park for him. Well, I mean, he also can just... Yeah, I guess those guys make... They have energy. Like that. So they can make the area black because they have lightning. You know. Yeah, it makes sense. <laughs> they, they suck all the light out and they're like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is another one of those games. We were just talking earlier today with Cheeky Cheeky Boys. Check out that playthrough, uh, which will probably be just a couple videos behind this. Anyway, that games that you can just beat, pretty awesome. Like on older games that you can just beat. Like nowadays, honestly, the, the only thing, besides maybe Dark Souls games, the only thing stopping you from beating a game nowadays is just like patience. Yeah, you know? it's, it's how long it is, because games are so, like, especially AAA games, are so homogenous that they need to have, like, the same staples, and it's like, you just can't make a five-hour game anymore. Yeah. It's gotta be, like, it's gotta be, like, eight hours of good content, but then they add, like, 20 hours of filler, at least. Yeah. So, yeah, and like I said, unless it's, like, a Dark Souls game, literally, like, there's nothing stopping you from beating a game, it's just your amount of care and your amount of patience to do so. And there's been plenty of games where I've started and I'm like, nope. And I just don't beat them, you know? Because it's just like, it's only a matter of that. Whereas old games, it's like a matter of, yes, yeah, sometimes with the patience. But sometimes it's just like, like, I want to beat Bart's Nightmare so bad for the Super Nintendo. I mean, actually beat it with like an A grade, aka beating all the levels. But like, I, I just can't, even with all the practice for 25 years... Is that a game that you've been, like, consistently playing, or have you not practiced it in a while? I've, pra I've practiced it every once in a while. Like, every time I pull out the Super Nintendo, I definitely play it. Hello. Please, please no crush. Thanks. Wow, this game also has really long levels. I'm gonna guess it's probably one of those that has, like, seven or eight levels. Yeah. With the length, it might even be, like, only like six. Yeah. Alright, we'll do this boss or whatever. Uh... <laughs> I, uh, watered Barney. Pow. Can I hit you in the face? Dude, their iframes is, like, crazy. It's like two seconds of iframes. Yeah. I also will say that it's amazing that this game is good, despite having a staple problem that I would have with a game like this, where, uh, your attack animation... It's short. It's so short. Yeah. But since you can take so many hits and, like, enemies yeah, if it was aren't... Like, if it was, like, a one-hit death kind yeah. of thing, it'd be awful. You can take a lot of hits, and the enemies aren't, like, super aggressive. Also, uh, I mean, I'm about to die, but, like, I could have played this much better. But I'm just trying to... Oh. Oh. Uh, that's cool. Probably what you're supposed to do. Well, and if... Oh, it starts me right here, so I have Ooh, no reason not to be this yeah. dang boss. Did it. And then I got a light back. back. Hey, it's Barney's fishing hook. And then I just run. I, I did that. I ran off screen. <laughs> you owe me for this one, Barney, my boy. Hey, do you want Fred? Yeah, but that's, <laughs> that's yeah. a good. Uh... Let's start. Let's end off on that. All right, so there you go. It's a very solid Genesis game. Something you can probably beat. Have a good day, and thank you for watching.